What's going on guys, Billy here, and today we're going to take a look at how to fix a crooked horizon in your drone footage. Now, I'm personally using the Phantom 4 Pro right now, but don't worry, this will work with all DJI drones, whether you have the Phantom 3 series, the Phantom 4 series, or the Mavic Pro. Whenever I look at a horizon that is not perfectly aligned, it's always the first thing that catches my eye, but it is fairly easy to fix, so let's get into it. Now to start things off, let's discuss what could make your horizon tilted in the first place. The number one reason would have to be taking off from a slanted surface. You want to always try to take off from a flat surface as this will calibrate your gimbal correctly upon startup. Now here you'll see that I have my drone a little under 400 feet in the air with the camera tilted towards the ground, and we can automatically notice that the horizon is tilted or unaligned. Now it's hard for me to make my horizon tilted on purpose, but there are times where it can be very drastic. To fix this, first we want to enable grid lines. We can find this under camera settings, miscellaneous, grid, and then grid lines. These horizontal lines on the screen will aid us in making sure the horizon is perfectly straight. Next we want to actually rotate the gimbal to make it perfectly straight. We can find this under settings, gimbal settings, and then adjust gimbal roll. Now all that's left to do is click the corresponding arrow in which way we want the gimbal to rotate. For me, I'm going to click on the right arrow to rotate it towards the left. This value can go up to 10.0, allowing you to fix even the worst on alignment. The value that I ended up going with was 0.5, I thought that that seemed to look the best. But you guys will probably get a different value, as everyone's on alignment is usually different depending on where they take off from. Now let's take a look at the raw footage. First of all, we have the one with the tilted horizon, and as I said, it's really not all that drastic, but it was hard to actually go out of my way and make sure that the gimbal was uncalibrated as I was taking off from a fairly flat surface. Here's the footage with the adjusted horizon using the gimbal roll feature. Although it wasn't all that bad to begin with, it does help to make slight tweaks to make sure that it looks perfect. So guys, that about does it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here as I haven't tried to upload daily. Also leave a comment down below if you have any questions whatsoever about adjusting your gimbal roll. It is super easy and super straightforward, but I know that some of these things can be quite confusing. So guys, as I said, this video is coming to an end, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.